Hey, what's up guys? It's Luke, Black Sheep 217 on Pokemon the Trading Card Game Online and at Zoom Battle Gym on Facebook. Find me at both of those places. I'd love to friend you and get to know you. That would be so awesome. Well, this is my third video with Relentless Flame and I'm like hoping and praying the third time is the charm. The last two videos, no victories with Relentless Flame. I promise you, it is a really good deck. And if you watched either of those videos, let me know if I did anything that um, I could have done to possibly win the game. I always try to like think about these games after I play them and try to come up with like the mistake that I made. Like what makes mistake did I make that made me lose the game? Or did I play it well enough where maybe it was just I didn't draw as well as the opponent or something like that. Let me know, because I'm always trying to grow as a player. So like I said, third time I'm really hoping is the charm. I'm gonna play the Relentless Flame deck. It's been a great deck for me. Don't know why we're losing with it right now, but hopefully this third video with Relentless Flame will be, like I said, the charm and we can get a victory. I don't know. Crushing Current. Now, I don't know if this is going to be very fair. Crushing Current, isn't that like one of those freebie decks that you get at the beginning? I see Zapdos. Okay, I don't I don't know. Okay, I, I don't know. I never see Crushing Current, but I'm weak to Lightning with, um, with Farfetch'd here, so that could possibly be a very bad thing. Let's see, let's just see what happens. Kangaskhan, Pikachu. Alright. Rotata. So, this deck, Crushing Current, this is like one of those decks you get for free. Um, not a really good deck at all. So, I should win. <laughs> I really should win. I'm gonna get a Charmeleon and I'm gonna get a Rapidash. But you know, this thing these these types of things always make me very nervous. Because just because I should win due to the matchup doesn't mean I'm gonna win. Right? I mean yeah, that's definitely a thing. And Kangas Khan's gonna hit for uh, 40 on this one. Probably gotta get far fetched out of there pretty quick. Alright, so. We gotta start powering up Ponyta. I'm gonna put another far fetched in here. I don't want Kangaskhan to reach Mega Punch status. I think that would be really terrible. So let's go ahead and throw in Rapidash. We're going to switch him in. And I think I'm just gonna... Ooh, no. You know what? Ponyta's coming out first. And then we'll Searing Flame. So 20 plus another one he gets burned. Alright, so 40 damage. That's good. My guess is he's going to Tiny Punch me for 40. Which I don't consider a Tiny Punch. I mean, a Tiny Punch I guess for Kangaskhan, right? That's pretty strong. But I'm hoping that my agility will kick in here. So let's see if I get a heads here. Yes! Kangaskhan can't do a thing against me. Agility is such a crazy ability. I mean, just to not get damaged. I mean, he can stay in there for so long with that ability. It's amazing. So Kangaskhan is going down next turn, unless he retreats, which he did. And he lost all that energy. Ouch. Ouch. That's terrible. He's got four cards. I have a Cynthia. 
I don't want to lose my Charmeleon, but you know what? I think it's better. Let's just put one on there, and let's just Cynthia out this. Let's see what I can draw. Okay, so a Nest Ball. So that might be able to get me Charmander, which I definitely need. And then just Agility, because Agility is awesome. Deal 60, we can take out most of these weaker Pokemon. And then we have a chance to avoid all damage on the following turns. Pretty incredible, if you ask me. Now, my opponent here is really hurting for energy, so they can't do much. They can't do much at all. So, I'm feeling pretty good here, but have you ever gotten that feeling where you feel pretty good and then you lose anyways? <laughs> That's happened to me a few times, <laughs> so you can never let your guard down in, in this game, or any game for that matter. So Eevee's in, and uh, let's go ahead and put Nidoran out. Uh, I think Professor Kakui would be great. Yeah, even though I don't need the extra damage, I think maybe extra cards is nice. And I'm going to power up this far-fetched, and we're going to go ahead and agility again. Alright, still no immunity. So if I was him in the background, I would be just trying to charge up, like, King is Khan or something. I don't have any cards that can, like, lure out bench Pokemon. I think that's one thing that this deck would be, you know, really great if it had, if it could lure out something. But no. But my draws have been, look at this, they've been pretty terrible. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's power up the other Ponyta, and I, I'll just copycat, because I don't need those cards in my hand. There we go. Charmeleon and a Howl. Those are much better cards. And kaboom. There goes Voltorb. But I kind of feel bad here. This this is this is not a matchup that like is at all fair. I mean Relentless Flame against Crushing Current. It's just super uneven. Like the Pokemon in Crushing Current can't even stand a chance versus Relentless Flame. So this is actually, I think, kind of a boring video to watch. So I'm sorry that the, the gameplay action in this is going to be super boring. Because it's just going to be Rapidash knocking everybody out. That's all, he's, that's, all that's going to happen. Because Rapidash is... Well, here's to the side of me. Because Rapidash does 60 damage, and look, I can just call in Charizard now. <laughs> With that, there it is. I mean, there's... I, I'm, I'm feeling like, okay, there's like no way to lose right now, right? Like, there's like no way to lose against this Pokemon. So, but we'll just keep it with Rapidash. Just knocking people out left and right. He even got a Heads on that one, so no damage can come to him. This guy's just drawing cards, so pretty sure we're going to have pretty clean, easy, simple victory, but, you know, to me, it's not a satisfying victory. I got, I played, you know, I played two, in those past two videos, we got the losses. You know, when you want to try to rebound, you want to rebound against, like, a, I don't want to say he's not worthy, but the deck I don't think is worthy of. Relentless Flame. I mean, I'm not even paying attention at this point. Rapidash is just knocking everybody out left and right, and there's nothing you can do. Like, zero. Now, Rapidash can't take out Jolteon, unfortunately, but I'll just throw in Charizard and then Roaring Resolve it and knock Jolteon out. So there goes Rattata, got a card. So next turn, this is over. Okay, so he tried to do that, but I'm just gonna retreat him. And let's just end the suffering now. So, Roaring Resolve. 
and he's going to get two fire energy. And then we'll blaze ball, and that's all. That's all she wrote. So a victory. But like, like I said, it's a hollow victory. I mean, beating that deck doesn't make me feel very good. So I guess I could say third video is the charm. But in all honesty, you know, I wanted a deck that was a current deck, something that could match up better against Relentless Flame. Now, guys, if I lost against that deck, oh my gosh, I would be so in the dumps. I mean, like, way down in the dumps. So, the, because I beat it so easily, it's, it's more like, it's not me, it's the deck. You can't play super old decks in the theme deck format because they make them better and better and better. And the thing I was saying about Relentless Flame is it's it was made a while ago, but I feel like it's still as good as current decks and can beat current decks. And that's what I want to do. So I don't know if we'll have another Relentless Flame video. I just wanted to make sure that I got a victory. It's just this victory was not the victory I wanted to get, really. But it is what it is. And I guess the victory is a victory. It's like the, you know, 92 Chicago Bulls versus, like, the Bobcats when they had the worst record in the NBA. Completely unfair. But there you have it. Thanks for watching with me. Hopefully next time we'll have a little bit better of a game. But I appreciate you joining with me today. I'll see you next time.